almost died earlier this year from cardiac arrest. Now he is thanking the men who saved him. Brett Vickery has the story from Greenfield. Nick Barantis says he will never take another day for granted. If you've ever had a first responder come to your house for anything, they're there to help you. And a little thank you goes a long way. Back in May, he called his sister saying he wasn't feeling well. When she found him on the floor of his home, she called 911. They came, took me out of my house. The second I walked out of the house, I went into cardiac arrest. For 36 hours, Barantis was on life support. <laughs> on Wednesday, he went to the Greenfield Fire Department to thank the men who saved his life. The whole thing was a miracle, and they, 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 they brought me back to life. I said, got to go, and just have to thank these, these wonderful guys here that saved my life. It, it just was something that I had to do. For the first responders, they say this is why they do what they do. It's just overwhelming the, the amount of uh, joy you get when you see somebody come back from death, basically. I was glad that everything kind of worked out and he was able to come up and meet us. Um, but yeah, it's, it's, it's a good feeling. For Barantis, he's just happy to be here. They're awesome people. They do wonderful things. Um, and I'm glad I'm here to say thank you. In Greenfield, Brett Vickery, Fox 6 News. The rest of his family wants to meet the men who saved their loved one's life. They all plan on meeting at the fire station sometime in the near future. And good for him for realizing something was definitely wrong to call first responders. Smart. And, A lot of things went in, into play at the right time.